Welcome back to my channel SOLIDWORKS Tutorial. Today we gonna create the part 02 by using SOLIDWORKS 2020. From this advanced SOLIDWORKS exercise video tutorial, you will learn the use of sketch tools, like rectangle, circle, smart dimension, fillet, trim, etc. You will also learn the use of feature tool. Like extrude and extrude cut. Hope you will stay connected with us and continue learning advanced part modeling by SOLIDWORKS. We will use 6 sketches, 3 extrude, 1 extrude cut, and 1 loft commands for completing this SOLIDWORKS 2020 advanced part modeling tutorial. We gonna sketch the rear view of the part, and extrude it. Then we will sketch the bottom part and extrude. Then we'll make this area. And at the end we will make this rib. Hope you will learn with fun and stay connected with us by simply subscribing my channel. Let's start. Click on new part. Go to apply scene and select plain white. For selecting material go to edit material and choose your desired material. First, we gonna sketch the rear view of this part. Left click on the front plane and select sketch. Take center rectangle command and draw a rectangle like me. Take smart dimension. Height of the rectangle is 100 millimeters. Width of the rectangle is 76 millimeters. Now we will fillet these corners. Press OK. Take fillet command, and fillet radius is 12 millimeters. Select these corners for fillet. Press OK. Now we will draw these circles. Take circle command. Control selects the circles and make them equal. Take smart dimension. Circle diameter is 12 millimeters. Distance is 12 millimeters. Center to center distance is 52 millimeters. This distance is 88 millimeters. Control select the centers and make them horizontal. The sketch is fully defined. From the feature menu select extrude. Extrude depth is 12 mm press OK. Now we will make this bottom part. Lefty click on the surface and select sketch. Take rectangle command and draw a rectangle like me. Control select these lines and make collinear.
the distance is 50 mm. Take Smart Dimension command. Distance is 50 mm. Now we will fillet these corners. Take fillet command, fillet diameter is 12 mm. Select these corners and press OK. Now we will draw these circles. Take circle command and draw circles like me. Control select the circles and make them equal. Make them horizontal. Take smart dimension. The diameter is 11 millimeters. Circle center to center distance is 52 millimeters. This distance is 12 millimeters. The sketch is fully defined. Now we will do the extrude. Go to feature menu and select extrude. Reverse extrude direction. Extrude depth is 12 mm. Make merge result checked on. Press OK to complete extrude. Now, we will make this portion of the part. Left click on this surface and select sketch. Circle diameter is 48 mm. Take circle command and draw circle like me. Take smart dimension. We will take a parallel plane with front plane at a distance 46 mm and draw a circle there. Then we'll use loft. Press OK. Exit the sketch. Select the front plane. Take a new plane parallel to it. The plane distance is 46 mm. Press OK. Left click on the plane and select sketch. Take circle command and draw a circle like me. Take smart dimension. Circle diameter is 38 mm. Press OK. Exit the sketch. Take loft command. Select these circles as loft profile. Make merge result checked on. Press OK. Hide the plane. Sketch on the surface and draw a circle like this, whose diameter is 20 mm. Go to Feature menu and select Extrude Cut for removing that portion. Select Through All. Press OK.
Now we will make this rib. Left click on the surface and select sketch. Take center line command and draw line like this. Take offset command. Select bi-directional. Select the center line for offset. Offset distance is 12 divided by 2 equals to 6 millimeters. Press OK. Select the circle and convert it. Do the same for this line too. Now take trim command and trim these unwanted lines like me. Ok, it's perfect. Press OK and go to Feature menu and select Extrude. Reverse the extrude direction. Select up to the next. Make merge result checked on. Press OK for completing the extrude. Make the speed 3x. Change this duration to 30 seconds. Congratulations! This is the part which we were trying to build. If you like the tutorial, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Because, more advanced level part modeling tutorial is coming on soon.